Alexa, turn on all the lights. There was no hurricane. There, uh, there was no hurricane. I had this like great epic idea, like I was gonna like weather report from the hurricane. I was gonna do all these. Fu I had this whole plan for the hurricane. No hurricane. That's weird. So I checked out of the hotel, and I'm back. So weird. So weird. So I had this whole plot, it just, uh, it happened with like Irma, where like, they said it was gonna be this big whole hurricane, and then it was just like a category one hurricane when they said it was gonna be category four. I feel like it happens a lot down here in Florida. I'm back. Alrighty, there is a uh, there's a positive update on the storm. I'm gonna update you right now. Yep. Starbucks is open again. I'm doing it. Good, thank you. Totals 8:42. Cool. You want to see with that? No, thank you. All right, no worries. Finally, Starbucks is back open. Man, I've been craving, craving this for a little bit. Anyways, I wanna have like a quick, I wanna have a quick heart to heart with you. So, all right, so like right now, um, the past 24 hours have been going a lot. I, I just been some personal family stuff that's been, that's been going on. Um, and one of those, one of those things that, that's come up is, um, w one of those things that's come up, y y you know what, let me, let me make this a little more personal. I, uh, I love this little park here in the middle of Winter Park. Anyways, like, I, so I'm going through this whole family thing and it came up that, like, I do work a lot. I work six days a week, 16 hours of those I'm working, and, like, it, it, it's a lot, and... It's, it, it comes to the point where like, am I working because I love to do it or I'm working because I feel like I kind of have to. Um, and, and I mean, I mean it, that's kind of like the watered down version of what, part of what, what my family and I and really close friends and I were talking about. And like, I, I, I think daily vlogging and m making a new creation, a new piece of content every day can be daunting. And I've, I've loved doing it, and it's been it's been a crazy ride. I've met some crazy people. I've had some crazy fun, and just some so sometimes just bizarre experiences vlogging. Um, by no means am I, am I ending vlogging, but uh, I I feel like I have to do like one thing. I, I know I don't have to, but I feel like in my head I have to do one thing or another. And I'm not stepping down from any of my businesses either. But I, I really want to try to like focus on these vlogs and try to make these vlogs more than just what they are now. Like if you didn't know, I take like two or three hours out of my day, I film these vlogs and at night I edit these vlogs and they go up in the morning. And, and, and I just feel like sometimes that I'm doing these vlogs because I said I was making a daily vlog. Not because I want to make a daily vlog. Um, sometimes, but it's sometimes really hard to make a daily vlog, especially when you have people who are saying that you can't do it. And I've, I've talked about this in one of the or other episodes that, like, when people watch my vlogs and they tell me that and they're liking the vlogs, it makes it motivates me to want to make more vlogs. Um, and sometimes the opposite happens, and it makes me not want to do vlogging anymore. But I have to fight through that, um, and I, I feel that 
me trying to really focus on these vlogs and kind of really nothing else will will bring another creative twist in my career. Um, I do work very hard to make sure my companies are the best they can that they can be, and sometimes I have to let nature take its course. Um, no means am I leaving any of my companies, but my team and I have talked extensively, um, and I think more and more and more I'm going to start focusing on these vlogs. Um, and I just think me as a creator, I'll be happier. Um, and we, I mean, we're still going to be working together. I still have some really fun, exciting projects that we're working on. But in, in, for me to be there every day on the battlefield, in the middle of the, you know, just smack in the middle of that first line can be daunting as well as making a vlog. So it's gonna turn into me more of a yay or nay sayer and kind of just running the business from a business side and not as much as a production side. Um, and I'm like really like nervous about that, but I'm also really excited. Um, I, I just I just felt like I had to share that here in these vlogs because you guys are like my therapist and it helps me like think these things through. Um, it helps me process them. So I just wanted to let you guys know. There's, sorry, there's a band playing in a restaurant over there. I just had to let you know. I'm, I'm nervous, I'm also excited. So I'm sorry if like these past days have been like, I haven't really been myself, um, and I'm sorry if these next few days won't be myself, but it's just me trying to come to terms with kind of what what is happening um, in my career and in my, uh, in my in my businesses as well? Yeah. Did I not press record on that? Let me do that again. So, uh, that is a, uh, my sister sent me that video. She's at some club, restaurant thing in New York City. She lives in New York City. So in New York City, um, I don't know, she, I love jazz. If you didn't know, I love jazz. I think jazz is really cool. I didn't know my sister liked jazz. Yeah. I don't know. I think that, that's, it's just kind of cool. That time I pressed record.